It also happens very often if there is a judicial commission, the judicial commission gives a recommendation that these are the people we have found guilty and therefore the cases against A, B, C, D should be filed. In this case, there is no such recommendation about criminal prosecution and I have been through the commission and I feel so, it's but such an unfortunate situation but that so women are the... not in a position, they feel so vulnerable that they are not in a position to name the predators. This is a very unfortunate situation so which has to be redressed. So many cognizable offences are there in the report. Then why don't uh, government can take a so moto case in, no, in this no. kind That's of No, that's not allowed under the law. Please yes. understand the law. We can register, please. We can register FIR if a cognizable offence is please, reported. Please understand, in cases of sexual assault, particularly in cases of sexual assault at the workplace, there are very, very specific laws which are there in India. I think the media should understand something which is much deeper, which is we have to question a situation and a social environment where a woman does not feel the, uh, the confidence that she can come and register a case against a predator. This is something which is of deep concern. And the media has to play a role in this. Be responsible, please. Please be responsible. Please understand what the HEMA Commission has said. I have never seen a report like this, in which the Commission itself found that women were unwilling to come out and give statements that the commission itself had to invite, not once, not twice, but repeatedly. And I am so concerned that we are living in an age where women are breaking barriers and yet a working woman does not have the confidence to file a case against somebody. And that is the nature of this industry. There are laws against sexual harassment there is a State Women's Commission, there's a National Women's Commission, there is a law for protection of women at the workplace. The HEMA Commission report says that internal committees will not work. You need a new law altogether. You need a new tribunal altogether. Now, these are things which are very, very serious. And you set up a tribunal, but still, a woman will have to come with a complaint. So I believe the case is now before the Kerala High Court. The Kerala High Court itself, what I have seen of its judgment, has stated categorically that if there is to be criminal prosecution, the court will have to look at the nature of the complaint and whether the complainant wants to file the complaint. Uh, in, in and if case? the court says, see, as I told you, this is not a judicial commission, but the High Court has said only the court can take such a decision. Very correct. Now it is before the High Court. Undoubtedly, whatever the High Court says, the government is duty bound to implement it. There's no question about it. Ma'am, uh, Bengali actress uh, Srileka Mitra revealed director Ranjit Mitra said, Ranjit is the uh, state Chalachitra Academy chairperson. Should he want to retain? Well, as far as that particular case is concerned, I'm sure if the lady makes a complaint, and I'm sure she is, I've seen that interview, uh, very articulate and very bold. I'm sure if somebody reaches out to her to make a complaint, and once the complaint is registered, everything else will follow. So she all, 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 all